If that owner down there at the Dolphins keeps watching Fitzpatrick will this team to play better football than what he's been trying to do all year, I wouldn't mind I wouldn't mind seeing them try to get rid of them and have them land in Chicago and really turn that thing around. But like you said, if they don't turn around quick, the Vikings and the Packers are about to run away with this thing, and they got no shot going down the road. I like Fitzpatrick. I think he does make them better. Guy's tougher than a two-dollar steak as well. I mean, you know, ah. he's gonna put his head down, and get some extra yardage. I, if if he stays in Miami, eventually they are gonna accidentally win a game. And that's what Fitzmagic does. Exactly. That's what Fitzmagic is. Exactly. You ever go to a you ever go to a Chris Angel show? Mm -hmm. Magic's going to happen. Yeah. <laughs> you ever go to the guys that had the two uh, tigers that attacked each other? Siegfried and Roy. The magic happens. You ever go to a Ryan Fitzpatrick football game? Magic, magic happens. happens. That's just what ipso facto. You put Ryan Fitzpatrick on the field, magic's going to happen at all of his stops. You put him in the XFL, which is only going to pay f people fifty-five grand. Mm-hmm. I'm sure it's going to be great football, by the way. A lot of people have said I'm going to be commentating that. Yeah, lead commentator. I have not said that. <laughs> a lot of other people have said that. I have not said that. That's a lot of conversation. But if you get Fitzpatrick in that league, what's he going to do? Magic. That's just what Ryan Fitzpatrick does. And the Bears, even though their egos are probably not going to let them get past Trubisky, if they want to save this season, it's something they're going to have to do. It's just something you're going to have to do. Yeah, I mean, the Dolphins are staring down the barrel right now of potentially winning out if oh, Fitzpatrick continues You don't to play. want that? No, you don't. Well, Tua did get hurt, so, I mean, maybe everything's just kind of— By the way, Tua is a righty. He is. I learned. He is, yes. I've been saying just from my keen eye of college football analysts, which I am, mm -hmm. I am a college football analyst professionally. As a profession, I analyze college football. Correct. Both in public and in private. Mm-hmm. And when I watched Tua throw a football, it felt like what it looks like with me throwing lefty. He just so happens to have a lot more velocity and a lot more accuracy and a lot more wins and toughness and all that stuff you need. But it's still the, the form looks the exact same as when I throw. Mm -hmm. Turns out he was a righty. His dad tied his arm down to make him a lefty. <laughs> and I'm telling you, it looks like that. It looks like that by the way he throws. But now he's got these back-to-back -back years here with sprained ankle injuries where they're having surgery mid-season. That's not good for two. I think two is a heck of a football player, but I don't think he's earned the outright number one pick. I don't think that Air Bear character at Oregon has either. I don't think Jalen Hurts has either. I'm not sure anybody really has other than – that Burrow dude down at LSU. Yeah. Joe Burrow, yeah. He seems like the guy who could potentially be it. But none of that matters if Ryan Fitzpatrick fornicates around and gets a win for the Dolphins when they're trying to lose every game. They will win out. If it's, if it's they magic, might never lose again. I mean. <laughs> it, Put nah, Rosen I, back in the game if you're a Dolphins fan. Yeah. We want this guy who has never been good in the NFL back in. Now, that's not Rosen's fault. I think Rosen has fell – into some hilarious situations. Have quarterbacks and their skill alone been able to win games for teams in the past? Yes. Yes, that has happened. Rosen has not been able to do that. I still think Rosen could potentially be a good quarterback if he was in a perfect spot. But if you're the Dolphins and you're trying to just lose, Ryan Fitzpatrick's not the guy I want on the football field because that guy will win a game by himself. That makes sense for the Bears, too, because they have next to no draft capital left. So, I mean, if they give up, you know, Straight like capital. a – yeah. And draft capital. Well, wise. yeah, both, both I guess. Yeah. So, but if they give like a you know a fifth round pick and a, a seventh round pick, Dolphins are jacked. Exactly. Okay, we got forty five first round picks because we got rid of all of our other good players. Now we get rid of the magic. We pick up another fourth and a fifth, which we can potentially trade in again. I mean, they might have three of the first four picks in the NFL draft next year. Mm -hmm. They might get all those quarterbacks and just hope to hit on one of them. <laughs> but that it could all go away if you let Fitzmagic keep, continue to fornicate around and potentially win a game.